What is up my dudes and welcome back to the channel. Today I have a viewer suggestion, but before I do that, I would like to say, uh, if you're interested, please do join the Discord, have a wonderful growing community there, love to have you. Maybe we could play some games together, that would be awesome. If you haven't subscribed, subscribe to the channel if you like the content. Help grow the channel, lets me know that you enjoy the content, it really does uh, show me that I'm doing the right thing here. And also like the videos, you know, because engagement and stuff. But anyway, with all that out of the way, they suggested that I fly the F-104, any model. I only have the A and the C, and to be honest, those are probably the worst too. As you can see, I didn't even bother spading it. Before the suggestion, I had never flown the F-104 of any kind. Um, but yeah, I didn't bother spading it because as you can see, um, there's not really a point. It's going to be gunfighting at 10.0 the whole way, so uh, yeah. From what I've seen, um, you either get a great down tier or a horrible up tier. And that's really the only places you can go. It's straight up or straight down. But, uh, yeah. Let's take the flying lawn dart out for a spin. Alright, so we actually did get up tier to 10.7. Uh, J35, some phantoms and stuff. I'm not even really gonna, you know, wait until we make contact with the enemy because... It's only going to be about two or three minutes anyway before that happens. So let me talk a little bit about the F-104. So from what I've seen, it doesn't like to maneuver in any capacity under about 400, 450 miles an hour. That's about 600 kilometers an hour, I think. Maybe about 650, maybe. Um, and also, I was researching this plane before the video, and... I probably should have known this, but uh, I actually didn't know that they served in Vietnam. Yeah, I didn't know that because you really only hear about the F-4 and the Sky Raider and the Corsair, the Corsair 2 that is, the A-7. Uh, yeah, you never really hear about the F-104's involvement in Vietnam, so I thought that was pretty neat. Alright, a radar range of 23 miles and no radar ping, so there they are, there's the whole enemy team actually. Alright, you know what? Let's do it. I'm feeling ballsy. The MiG-21 saw me. Oh god, they're all MiG-21s. Nope, go away. Okay, I just flew into the entire enemy team. This is not where I want to be. At all. But, uh, let's see if I can't be missile bait. By the way, missile bait, this thing doesn't get flares. A lot of the other F-104 models do. This one doesn't. So that's kind of unfortunate. So if uh, one of these lovely MiG-21s decides that they want to put an R-60 up my butt, uh, yeah, I'm I'm screwed actually. So just gotta stay fast, uh, stay out of their missile range. It's about two and a half miles rear aspect, and uh, just fly. Oh God, he's gonna put an R-60 up my ass. I I can feel it. Oh, look, see, look, he just fired one and missed because I was turning. E nope, that's not, nope. That's not going to do anything. I don't have a G-suit. I don't know if this thing can, can get a G-suit. I don't know. But right now, okay, he's dead. Cool. I'm flying for my life. Got 10 minutes of fuel because I've been afterburning the whole fucking time. Alright. Let's try and get this MiG-21. Let's try and actually score a kill to this, this match. Instead of just flying around like an idiot. E Critted. Okay. He might actually go down. Oh yeah, he's on fire. He's dead. Oh my god, there's so many things. Oh yeah, I'm dead. I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead. I'm dead. Oh, okay. Critted. I'm still in the game. Kind barely. Oh god, he's gonna... F D oh no. Yep. I'm not gonna be able to get out of the- Ah, shit! Yep, I'm dead. And, yep. Look. Ah, oh, man. Why does this thing have to be 10.0? Why can't it be like 3.7 or something, dude? Alright, so we are back on Berlin, going supersonic. Always nice. I will say, the F-104 is, uh, an interesting looking plane. It's certainly- not really a plane that you would expect the Americans to produce. This definitely has like Soviet-esque design features like the the T-tail and all that stuff. 
Oh, dude. Same, though. <laughs> Same. <laughs> Nobody likes a plug. Hey, look at MiG-21. Yak-38. And you know what? Same exact deal. He's just going to go right into the enemy team and try and catch a missile. No one cares. I'm dead. I'm dead. I might be able to catch this Yak-38. Jaguar is chasing me. Oh, God. What's that? Oh, that's the MiG-21 again. Hello. Hi, Mr. MiG. He's going to put a missile up my butt. I, I can feel it. Yep, there it is. They're only R3s, so... Don't really have to be too scared. Okay, those are going to be R60s, though. Those are going to be scary. Oh, my God. Yep. Okay, bro. I can, I can still fly this. Oh, man. This is not going to be good for me. Yeah, no. Uh, uh, yes! No! Damn it. Man, this thing sucks. Alright, so we're back on Berlin. And, uh, flying this plane has been... It has kind of made me question the whole thing about every country in this game gets American exports but America seems to get the worst versions of their own aircraft like the the Italians have the F-104S that thing's amazing the, the Japanese have the F-104J that thing's amazing the Germans have the F-104G that thing is amazing and then we're stuck with the A and the C but the C is kind of dog and the A is probably no better like aim 9 B's at 10 10.0 dude this okay I thought he was gonna turn on to me that would have been bad yeah uh, as you can see 10 7 again because memes because um, guy guy Gibbles hates hates me yes that that's why oh okay I just got pinged that's cool eh nope Alright, Harrier. Ah, shit! Fuck me! Go away! Oh, look at that! Another R60 at my butt. Or an R3. Depending on which one fires a missile at me. Yep, R3. Okay, those are kind of easy to dodge. Okay. He's got one more. Makes one. Could have six R60s. Alright, dodge the second one. Oh my god, where's my team? They're so far away! Uh, like th this is gonna be me running. Because, okay, there's an R60. That, nope, R3? Okay, yeah, R3. Thank god the R3s kinda suck. Alright, I might just have to fly back to base. Okay, good, MiG-21 broke away. What's still on me? That MiG-19, MiG-19 is peeling off. Okay, good. Now I can actually start to hopefully do something. Going up, let's come back around and come back in. 18 minutes of fuel left. I do think it's interesting that the Air Force model of the F-104 has an arrestor hook. Then I was test flying it a couple days ago and I actually was able to land on the carrier. I don't know if you guys have ever landed the F-104 on a carrier, but it's weird because since the landing gear is so narrow and it's such a long plane, it kind of just like does this weird nose dive and then it just like pitches its tail into the the runway on the carrier. It's, it's really quite interesting how it is able to land itself. Okay, there's a Hunter. I would guess it's the premium FGA-9 variant because it's 97, so it is totally possible. Okay, those two just, oh my goodness. Explosion effects are so nice. Okay, I'm gonna go for that Jaguar. Let's hope I can actually secure a kill this game. It, literally, the match before I started recording, I got three kills. So, let's see if we can't pick one up. Critted, okay. Um, rear stabilizer shot off. Left stabilizer. He's probably going to fire a missile at me. Yep, there it is. Alright. Dodged. What's that, five now? Four? Yeah, four. MiG-21 fired one. 
And okay, F4. Shot down the Jaguar and assist. I'll take it. IL 28. This might be the only kill that I get this whole match. Actually, let me go for the MiG 21. It's him and the F4 doing stuff. The MiG 21's at low energy. No! You cunt! Damn it! It's just a little slow, a little low. Shit happens. A hurt. Really? A hurricane? I mean. Shit, I guess. Oh no, the, the other F-104 is going to do it to him. Oh yeah. Nope. Alright. I feel like a piece of shit! Oh. I'm, I'm a bad person. I'm going to hell. But you know what? A kill's a kill. Definitely not my best performance, but uh, this is the first match that I've actually lived through. And that's not good. It's not good that I've only survived one match in the F-104. Is there... Oh, there's still one guy left alive. Okay. Well, I'm gonna shoot up some light pillboxes because I don't know where this dude is. And I need points because I'm a shitter. Okay, blind hunt been activated. Where is this dude? Oh, Harrier in space. Nice. Alright, well, I'm gonna keep ground pounding, and, uh... That shitter is gonna be in space. Luckily, one of the F4s had a sparrow and just shoved it right up his ass. And, uh, that's game. Finished third place. I'll take Alright, I think I want to end it there on a high note. Um, if that could be considered a high note. Like I said... It just seems like the Americans get the worst variants of their own aircraft. And this is probably a really good example of that. How are you going to be at 10.0 and not not have fucking flares? It worked, damn it. Like, bro, you get an RWR, but what, what does that tell you? That someone's locking onto you? Like, you can just look at somebody who's behind you and fucking tell that they're locking onto you. It's not hard. Well, what the fuck, Gaijin? Free. Any anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed. Please subscribe if you enjoyed the content. Join the Discord server. Really love to have you there. Maybe we could play some games. If you've made it this far in the video, you're awesome, and I will catch you in the next one. Peace out.